I'm having fun. You're having fun. Let's have some fun. Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Right now, we're looking at beautiful, marvelous, magnificent, and the coolest comet I've ever seen before. C2020 F3 Neo Wise. It is separating itself from the sun. Well, I mean, they were never connected. They were just really close, you know. And you can see it in early morning skies if you are looking with very intelligent eyes. That is very exciting. And this thing will continue to get more exciting for about two more weeks, two and a half. Why am I in a good mood this morning? Could it be because you guys are awesome? Maybe. Could it be because we have yet probably another sunspot on the sun? We've had like three in the last few days. The last two showed up and then stayed for a day or two and were gone. But now we've got a new cycle proto spot. A sun spot is emerging in the sun's northern hemisphere. Its high latitude and magnetic polarity mark it as a member of new cycle solar cycle 25 to receive an official number and everybody loves official numbers the spot will have to grow and persist for at least a day so we'll keep an eye on it but i have noticed a connection whenever there are sunspots or coronal mass ejections i'm usually in a pretty good mood to have good energy because we have been going through a very deep solar minimum but we are headed towards solar maximum in the new solar cycle and it, it's kind of like a battle of wills. It feels like a time where the people, I don't know, there are people out there who think they can predict exactly what the sun is going to do for the next 15 years based off what the sun has done over the last 140, 200, 300, 400 years. And I don't think the sun is like that, dude. But, you know, that's the cool thing about life and the truth community. Everybody's entitled to their own opinion. Whether it be one man's opinion or some giant group's opinion. And we'll have to pay attention this year and for the next 14 years to see if their 15-year prediction is coming true. But the sun is definitely waking up. And, um, you know, I could be wrong. Maybe it will stay in a very deep, 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 deep solar minimum for 15 years. But I don't think that's what's going to happen, dude. I think it's going to be pretty exciting, pretty awesome, pretty modern solar cycle but stay tuned and as we see you know but i'm definitely tracking c2020 f3 neo wise how impressive will it get definitely in my opinion it's the most impressive comment i've ever seen since i've been doing the whole thor news thing and hopefully we'll all be able to see this guy pretty easily though you'll have to wake up early but right now i guess it is going to be getting closer to earth Notice again, all the planets from the same side cause a lot of imbalance, and so we're always on the lookouts for earthquakes and volcano eruptions. There's been quite a few. I'll cover that in a different video. But we have all the planets on the same side in a planet parade, and Neo Eyes and Earth will be getting closer to each other over the next, you know, two and a half weeks. So that is going to be very exciting. These are very exciting times. And I am lucky, glad, and happy to share them with you. Good morning, sunshine. I'm glad you're here with me. I'm going to keep this one short and sweet and get back into the groove. And yeah, dude, 2020 has been a major battle. It's like everyone is going through their own personal crisis. And everybody's trying to agitate everybody else. So let's try and tone that down. Let us de-escalate conflicts. And have some civilization stabilization. Well, I hope you guys have a great day. I love you. Stay cool. And I am extremely grateful for everyone in Asteroid Fight Club. Bye -bye. Whoa. 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 Oh, did I zoom? That's super zoomed in. That is definitely interesting. I mean, you don't have to be like... Look at the color in that thing. How bright will it get? We'll have to stay tuned because remember it is getting closer towards earth up until about the 24th or the 25th although it will be moving away from the sun so technically it'll be dimming at the same time a little as it gets closer so 
It's, gonna, it's already putting on quite a show, though, in my opinion. All right, I want you to have a great day.